Hey guys, welcome back to another video. Tonight I'm coming at you with a voiceover because I had a very, very unexpected situation. I wasn't even planning on recording this at all. I was out to grab some dinner and then I encountered this intersection where my Tesla decided to go on a red light, which is not the first time that this has happened. So what I did is I went back and now I'm pulling out of a little neighborhood here just to reverse out. And then I tried to replicate this exact same issue so I'll be turning here and making this left, and in just about 30 seconds, you'll witness that Tesla FSD is trying to go on red. And again, this is not the first time that this has happened, and it's, ext it's extremely critical that this video gets the right level of visibility so that we can get this to the right people on the Tesla AI team so that they can identify this once and for all. Because like I said... This is not the first time that this has happened, and it was a critical, critical disengagement. I almost actually got into a crash in this clip that you're about to see because there was a car pulling out from the other side, which had the right of way. They had the green light, and because FSD was about to go on red, which is where I almost caused the crash. All right, here we're rolling up to the red light. Keep an eye on the mile per hour and at the red light at the same time if you can. We're coming down to about four, three, four miles per hour. And then you see right here is where we just decided to go and I had to disengage. I'm going to rewind that again. We are slowly approaching this red light here. And keep an eye on the mile per hour going down to about three or four. And then it accelerates here up to about seven, which is where I ultimately disengage. And then this vehicle is pulling out from the other side. So if I let FSD go and I did not disengage, there were to be a major, major accident. If that other vehicle wasn't paying attention, uh, keep your eye out on the right vehicle there. See, we're coming out at the same exact time. So that would have been a disastrous, disastrous situation. Not the first time that this has happened. I don't know what it is about this intersection. And I would love for this video to get the right level of visibility so that this problem could get solved once and for all, because it's very very critical. So um, feel free to rewind it and watch it for yourself. You know, um, see the clip by clip play and leave your thoughts down below in the comments. Why, why do you think this happened? I really would like to understand why this is happening and um, leave it down below in the comments. If you see anything that I don't, or if you can identify a specific situation about this intersection, let me know in the comments below. Otherwise, if you could like this video to get the right level of visibility, like I said, that would be much, much appreciated. So again, this is a completely impromptu video for you guys. Uh, I wasn't even planning on recording. Like I said, I was out to grab some food um, and then I encountered the situation. So, and this is the second time, by the way, because the first time was um, when I was already driving back on this route. And then when it happened, I ultimately made a U-turn to try and replicate it again, and I succeeded in replicating it. So this is twice in a row is what you're seeing here. The first time was not recorded, uh, and the second time was. So again, thanks for tuning in. Like the video. If you can, comment what you think had happened here uh, to get it to the right eyes. So thanks again for tuning in. I'll catch you guys in the next one.